So today I'm gonna to be installing a nice little GLI diffuser on my Mark 6 Jetta. It's a 6.5, it's the facelift. So this is the GLI diffuser that I got. You're gonna need a T25. There's some screws under there that we're gonna be taking care of. I get this nonsense out of here. Yeah, this is kind of sticking out because some lady hit me a couple months ago, but we'll get into that another time. So underneath the car is gonna be like four or five of these. Can't even tell if you can see it or not. So there's a T25 there, there's one there, there's one over there, one over there, and I believe there's another one over here. We're gonna get working on that now. that there should be two more all the way over there slide over there okay I got one more left after this one and we got one more all the way over there by the wheel all right so after you got all the screws out make sure you don't lose them now this is the fun part. Make sure you get the tow hook off. Should pop right out, just like that. And then after, there's some little guides here. They like clip in. They more or less just start pulling. If you plan on selling it, or whatnot. Try not to break it. There we go. <laughs> this is so fun. Ooh. Yeah, definitely don't touch the exhaust. That thing is still hot. It's also 85 degrees out here. This is normally the hardest part right here. There we go. Look at that. What a difference that is. So now, I'm gonna put this bad boy in there. That's what it currently looks like. Kinda just reverse the same process. First, you wanna try to line it up. Just pop into place. There you go. Ah. So my bumper has like a lot of play to it. I guess it's because that stupid lady who rendered me but you really gotta push on it. Or you can reach on the back and you'll feel your little styrofoam shock absorber over there. I don't even know what that's called, but look back towards it. You can press against it. 
basically you just want to hit it into place pop it back in at the same time making sure that all your things are in the right position like I just put my thing in there and it's not a, in the right spot so I gotta move it Almost, almost there. It's a little bit more, a little more pushing. So that's the finished product after all the screws, bolts, and clips are in. You gotta make sure that you can't see any of the clips along the line, along the guide, but this, what it's going to look like.